What's going on guys? This is your boy Proud Man. I'm bringing you another episode of Pokemon Apex. Uh, another episode where the music was muted. I I don't know guys. I I'm I'm really thinking of switching um, from my recording software to a different one. I could easily use VSDC vi free video editor in order to record vi videos. I think. Hi. Oh, hey there. I uh, I can help you give Pokemon nicknames to your Pokemon. You know, if, if you want. You see, you can't just go calling your Pokemon by a new name. They uh, they get confused. You have to train them to learn a, a new name. You know. M my sister says I should charge 500 to teach your Pokemon a new name. I think that probably sounds right. Sorry, I I used to do it for free, but my sister says we gotta you know start making a living for ourselves and stuff. So, uh, you want to give your Pokemon a new nickname? That's cool. Um, it costs 500, if that's okay. Nah, I'm good. Oh, uh, that's fine. No problem. Come again, please. Hey there. You look like a feisty trainer. Boy, do I have a deal for you. For only one easy payment of $1,000, I can make your Pokemon relearn any of, of its moves. And when you believe it, sometimes Pokemon remember moves that they can never learn through leveling up. Hey kid, looks like you got the moolah, so step right up and have your Pokemon learn an old move. What do you say? Alright, let's see. Let's see what we got. Scratch and Harden. No. Let's see. Let's check out True One. Astonish, Taunt, Pursuit. No. I'll come back when... This cat is adorable. Even it has a coin in the middle of its forehead. <laughs> there are a bunch of books here in Pokemon Psychology and Training. Now open. Move earning services. Cheap, cheap, cheap. Come by now. Now open. Open now. <laughs> Something tells me they're desperate. Dr. Hershua Winston, inventor, puzzle master extraordinaire. There's the doors locked, but there's a sign in the door. Close for renovations. We'll return shortly. Guess I'll come back later. You must know, I'm standing in the shade here to protect my fair complexion. I must have forgotten my parasol at home. Oh, woe is me. <sighs> Let me guess, you've come to make fun of my pitiful Amelia of the Drake family too? Um, actually... Oh, no need to say anything. I understand. The prophetic Drake family always claiming that their family has this long-lost treasure, but has nothing to show for it. Who wouldn't want to make fun of something so hilarious? I would- I think you might- Well, for the record, I just want to say that I don't believe in that stupid treasure. There's no way it exists. If it did, someone would have been able to pick up the trail for it in Successless Forest. But since nobody can find where my great-great-great-times infinity grandfather hid the clues, there's no way it's real. You're not even listening to me, are you? You know what? Why don't you go look for that damn treasure since you think you're so special? You know what? If you find the treasure, you can keep it. I don't want it anymore. Okay then, will do. <laughs> cool. I'll be uh, gotta remember to do that. There's a bunch of cheesy young adult novels here. Lots of mushy romances with cardboard protagonists. Go through people's drawers, rude. <laughs> There are a bunch of old maps and charts on this shelf. I think most of them are top topographic top topographic maps. I'm sure someone understands this, but I sure don't. Doors locked.
So many Pokeballs right behind a, a convenient rock. Do you follow any pro trainers? Uh, I don't think I know any. What? How do you not follow pro trainers? Oh boy, you got a lot to learn, kid. Let me teach you a thing or two. Okay. Whew, alright. So pretty much everyone is into Pokemon Battles. But that PBL, or Pokemon Battle League, is the real deal. They get the strongest trainers from all over the world to do a good out. At the end of each session, the best of the best head to Babylon for the World Pokemon Championship. It's a tournament that draws huge crowds and gets broadcast live on TV. So sports then, got it. It's not just a sports man, it's a way of life. Every kid aspires to be a pro trainer someday. If you see them battle sometime, you'll understand. My favorite trainer is this amazing guy called Bam Baphomet, the Inferno. He totally scorches the competition with his fire type team. He's the current reigning champion, and I can't wait to see him win again this year. Sounds like this guy's a big deal. I'll keep an eye out for him. If you ever want to talk about pro trainers again, just hit me up. Ah, we're back here. And yeah, that path, path is blocked by a rock, so south we go. Ooh, there are electrics here. I need to remember that. That would be a good combination for my quote-unquote rain team. I heard that a Pokemon called, called Skitty can sometimes be found in this town. It's so adorable, I must acquire one. Now all I have to do is wait patiently in this field until one walks by. Let's play Megazord. I'll be Megazord, and you could be his arch nemesis, Dr. Poigood. Hit me with the force bomb. 
Just in case he's being cheeky with the counter. Oh my goodness. Oh wow. Okay. That's good to know. I did not know it works with multi-attacking moves and it works with the last hit. Oh wow. Double crit. Megazord was defeated? Inconceivable. Check out my school Megazord friend. Here, let me punch you in your number. Alright, let's go back to that hotel, heal up real quick, and we could continue. I talked to you before? Hello there, Yangin. The name's William, but you can call me Willie. I went this way before. What are you looking at, kid? Nothing pretty, that's for sure. Hello, Derry. I saw herbal medicine that they don't have anywhere else. It's all natural and cheap, but your Pokemon won't like it. <laughs> what can I get you? I don't need anything like that. Energy powder. I guess I'll get five of those. Everything else I'll hold off on for now. There's a book laying on the bed here. Let's take a look. Like fine wine, your guide to spicing up the bedroom after 60 years. Ick! Nope, nope. Yuck! I guess that's what I get for snooping. I have no words for that. <laughs> okay, so I'm back here. Wait. I'm guessing that Pokeball can only be acquired from Smashing Rock 2. Alright, let's keep heading downwards. about this house. My little brother is obsessed with a superhero co show called Megazord or something. It's got toys, trading cards, comic books, even clothing based on it. 
I thought it was just a dumb show for little boys at first, but apparently there are grown women who are really into it. I don't understand. Meh, this town ain't really my scene, you feel? It's so quiet and peaceful. Gah! I could just die of boredom. One of these days I'm gonna get out of here, just wait and see. Yep, another rock smash rock. Oh, so we're back here. Rosemary Market. Welcome to the Rosemary Market. I hope you find a great deal today. Welcome, welcome. If you are in need of uh, any Pokeballs, you've come to the right place. Please note that due to regional Pokeball shortages, our local supply is later to the limited and prices are slightly higher than usual. We apologize for the inconvenience. Alright, what you got? Wow, 1500? I'll buy six of them. This is a sales Pokemon off of Pokemon. It doesn't appear to be functional. Man, Pokemon ball. Pokeballs are so expensive. One day I'm gonna save up my allowance and buy one. Then I'll go on a quest to be the bestest Pokemon trainer that ever was. <laughs> I need a medicine? You got what you need to keep your Pokemon happy? Don't put your team in danger by going out with some potions. Got. Oh, I was not expecting all of these. Let's get one super potion, two potions, paralyze you. The rest I probably won't need. This place gets really busy on the weekends. It's the biggest attraction in town after all, so I suppose that makes sense. I'm just here for the great, great deals. What you got here? Berries here, get your fresh picked berries here. You there, would you like to try a free sample? Yes. Ooh, a Petra Berry, nice. What you got? Orange, Petra, Ross, Cherry, Chester, Rust, Aster. Let's get two orange berries. Make sure to check back on your new crops coming in soon. I'm here to get some vitamins for my darling Skitty. She's got to take care of protein if she wants to grow up to be a vicious attacker for her mommy. <laughs> Welcome, we got all kinds of vitamins to whip your Pokemon into tip top shape. Yeah, like just as expensive as I thought it would be. Head out to an unknown. Don't go unprepared. Make sure to take some of my rugged field items with you. Escape rope, propel, glow stick. The plastic tube containing chemicals that react to create a soft light when the tube is bent. That's 250 steps. So it's a, essentially flash. Whenever I'm going out, I, I always bring some repel. Running into a wild Pokemon at every few steps is such a hassle. Okay. That was pretty productive. And are there two entrances to this place? Yes, there are. <coughs> Arcasia outskirts. But first things first, let's see if I could find a... Uh... I want to see if I could get that, um, what do you call it? Um, 
electric. Hey, Skitty! I'm tempted to catch this thing just to see if I can, um, just to see if I can get it, get her to trade something for, to me for it, but nah. Another one. I would hope this game would be more specific if that was the case. Like if you catch a, a skitty, I would give you something worthwhile. Radita. That would have been very. Oh no!
All right, let's go back and try to find this uh, electric. Hey, there it is. Oh, come on. Alright, let's go for another bike bite. I'm hoping it doesn't kill. Okay, good. You're on red. These Pokeballs don't go on trays anymore, bro. What? You are not doing this to me. You realize that's like $3,000 I just spent right there. Yes. You know how much this hurts. That's $4,500 on an Electric level 13. Electric, let's see. Let's name it after uh, the subscriber Jeremias Pablo. So I'll just call it Jeremias. Oh, wow, a tailor. If you can live this. I gotta catch you. I gotta catch you now. Yes, at least it only took one. Nickname, let's call you... We're going with different names. I'll call you Sora after the subscriber Sora Axe Roxas Levick. In fact, I'll call you Sora X. Wait. Do I have six Pokemon? If so, then I'm gonna need to hold off. Wait, why did he go... Am I only allowed to have three? Am I only allowed to have three Pokemon in my, t in my party? Well, ain't that something else. Okay. Alright then, I'll end the episode right here guys, I will see you guys in the next episode.